Hey guys, it's Nova VA here, and I'm back with another video. Okay, so this is actually a request I got from someone. This is not the part two to my Jealous Eddie Munson X listener series. This is just a request I got from Ava Rodriguez to do an Eddie X listener eating disorder comfort video. And of course, I'm gonna do it because me and myself, personally, I have an eating disorder. Um, and I thought, what better way to not only probably listen to this to comfort myself, but to comfort other people. So, yeah. And also, before this video starts, just know that you do not have to starve yourself. Like, you are beautiful, and, like, you are just an amazing person, okay? Like, no matter what shape or size you are, you're literally gorgeous. And, like, I hope you never forget that. Because you have worth, and like, no matter you're skinny, curvy, chubby, whatever, like you're still gorgeous, and everyone is gorgeous. If you look at like, there are some people out there who are like morbidly obese, right? They're still beautiful, right? So why should you not be beautiful? Because you are. But anyway, let's get on with this video. Mothers of God. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> Okay, so let's just say that Eddie has been away for, like, what, four months doing something with his band, and, like, let's say they've been on tour, because, like, it's been blowing up recently, you know? Yeah, yeah, okay. And you've been hanging out with, like, your girl besties, like, you've been hanging out with, like, Nancy, Robin, Max and Eleven, and, you know what, we'll put Erica in there as well. And, like... You've been paying a lot of attention to, like, Nancy out of the lot. Because, obviously, Nancy's beautiful. She's, like, pretty. She's gorgeous and all that stuff. And you guys have been trying on clothes. And, like, you see them. And they're just looking so beautiful. Like, they look cinched. It's amazing. And then, like, when you try it on, you just kind of feel, like, out of place. You feel bloated. And you just feel, like, so insecure. And then you start to, like, feel like you need to get more like them in order to start, quote, start bleh, in order to, like, feel yourself. So, without that, you start eating less. And you start to just kind of push the food away. And it becomes kind of a problem. And you start getting more thinner, you get more pale, and all that, and all that jazz. And then after a few, after the months, Eddie then comes back to see you like this. So, yeah, that's your little setting, I guess. I can't believe I've been away for so long. It's been forever since I've seen her. I can't wait to see her again. Oh, come on, listener, open the door. Hey, surprise, sweetheart. I'm back. Your amazing boyfriend is back from tour, obviously. <laughs> Are you okay? You look kind of pale. Are you okay? <laughs> Listener, like, you look really sick. Like, really sick. <laughs> Are you positive you're okay? Hey, no. Listener, you can talk to me. Like, I'm here for you, you know? Like, I know I've been away for, like, so long, but, like... Can you still talk to me? What do you mean it's nothing, sweetheart? Obviously it's something if you're looking pale. Are you okay? Like, you can just- can you just tell me? Okay, like, I promise not to get mad at you. You then start to, like, cry. Like, you start to tear up. Like, you just get really teary-eyed and you kind of start shedding a few tears and stuff. So, yeah.
Hey, listener. Hey, sweetheart. No, come here. Hey. Don't cry. Okay? I've got you. Okay? I'm not gonna let you go. He then comforts you for like, let's say, like, five minutes or so until you're ready to like tell him what's been happening. And yeah. You ready to tell me? Okay. I'm all ears. No. Listener, stop. No, stop. Listener, that's ridiculous. Who gives a fuck about Nancy's body? Yeah, don't get me wrong. She's like the best. We love Nance, okay? Sure, she's pretty, but so are you. You have to be starving yourself to look like Nancy, okay? You're literally the most gorgeous girl I've ever seen in my life. Like, when I look at you, it's like you take my breath away. Like, I wake up to your face almost every day knowing that you're mine. You. Like, and I'm so lucky to have a girlfriend with an amazing body, okay? Of course I don't want one of the skinnier girls, like the cheerleaders or whatever. I want you. So what if you've been getting bloated? Listener, I love you for who you are. No matter if you're skinny or if you're chubby, I'll still love you because you're listen. Look, I don't want this to come off like kind of weird, but like, you know, when we're like, when we, you know, um, yeah, when I just grip onto you, it's like, I see the stars, like, I swear I see the gates of heaven or some shit, because you're so goddamn gorgeous, like, I just feel blessed to have a girlfriend with one sexy body. I'm serious, like, I would not want anyone else, okay? Now, what do you say we get popcorn, we order a bunch of food, and we watch movies and cuddle? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> It's okay. You don't have to apologize. I'm here for you, okay? And please don't do this yourself, listener. Please don't do this yourself. <laughs> well, that was like really short. I'm so sorry about that, but by the way, guys. <coughs> I'm still a little bit sick. It's getting better, but like my cough is starting to go. Like, it was really bad, like, last week. But anyway. God, my hands are so sweaty. <laughs> anyway. Um, I was gonna say. Oh, yeah. It is, like, 5 a.m. right now. It's, like, it's 5.32 a.m., bruh. It's 5.32. I woke up at 3 a.m. I actually slept. Are you guys proud of me? I feel like I'm blowing on my mic. Oh, well. But, like, I literally was awake all night last night until like six in the afternoon and i fell asleep and i woke up at 3 a.m and i've been awake since 3 a.m so yeah you know anyway but you're not here for that anyway this is oh my god this is a long ass outro anyway i keep saying anyway i need to stop saying that word come on nova you can do this anyway no fuck god damn it okay so i hope you enjoyed this video guys um and if you're going through something like this like i said at the beginning you're so beautiful, okay? No matter 
how, what weight you are, how chubby or skinny or curvy or whatever. Like, you're still so fucking gorgeous. Like, you're still so fucking beautiful. Literally, if no one's gonna love you for that, I will love you. Like, I will love you. Like, if there's something you're insecure about, I'll love it for you. You don't have to love it, but I'm gonna love it. That sounds really weird, but, like, honestly, that's why I tell all my friends. It's, like, if you hate something about yourself, say your nose. Like, if you don't love it, I'll love it. Like, girl, if someone's gotta love it, I will. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, it is officially, like, the, the, what? The what? <laughs> I have two weeks off of school. So, this is, like, what day is it today? It's, like, Monday, right? Yeah, I've been off since Friday. Friday was our last day. But I wasn't there Friday. I didn't go to school last week. But anyway. So, get more videos uploaded. Hopefully. Um, so, mm-hmm. Yo. Yo. Um, except Sunday. Because that's it's Easter, bitch! I'm gonna get fat and eat chocolate, but okay. Oh, well, who cares? But anyway. Um, yeah. The next video I post will probably be my Robin X Kidnap listener. The start of that series. That'll be, I think, maybe two or three parts. Yeah. And I'll start recording the Jealous Eddie Month and X listener part two. And, like, probably post it, like, Friday? I don't know. I'll, I'll see. But anyway, I'll... What the fuck? Anyway, those are birds, but I'll see you guys in the next video, I guess. I love you guys. Stay safe, or whatever. Bye-bye. I love you. Mwah.